This is EJ's machine company in Fullerton. It makes parts for military and civilian planes. The machinists at EJ's take blocks of metal and cut the airplane parts out of those solid blocks. Denise Easton is president of EJ's. We make uh, parts for the C-17, uh, parts for the F-15, parts for the F-18, and a um, few parts for the ejection seat, the ACES-2. EJ's is a growing company, and NTMA graduates work here. There are 11 machinists who work here, and they all got training at NTMA. Did they do a good job for you? An excellent job. Um, we found that the training, that the basic training that they provided has really helped um, have our machinists ready to, to start in an entry-level position. We also have many of our machinists who've gone back for advanced training. Uh, so they get the right kind of training there? Huh? Yes, they do. Okay. And they, they fit right in? Yep, yeah, have a good work ethic and um, we trust uh, the screening process that NTMA uses and they do a really good job for us. When EJ's machine company is hiring, it gives preference to graduates of NTMA, says owner Skyler Easton. We've gotten some really good people. I haven't had a, a bad person from NTMA yet. Philip Rollins has been working at EJ's for more than three years. He got this job right out of NTMA. Yes, I started here about a week and a half before I graduated. And what were you doing before? I was in construction for about 12 years. Philip now works on the newest and most advanced piece of equipment at EJ's, and it's a job that is more secure than construction. As it's turned out, yeah, it is now, <laughs> definitely. It's definitely more regular, um, and with the economy being what it is, construction market right now is really down. Um, and uh, the C-17 isn't the only uh, parts we make here, but it's definitely our bread and butter. And, you know, we're busy. And the so there's more job security here. Oh, definitely, definitely. And I, I like what I'm doing. You know, that's what's important to me. You know, uh, I've been working for almost 40 years now, and, you know, I found that doing something that you enjoy is worth everything. Now, tell me about the training you got at NTMA. Did it prepare you for this job? Actually, it did. You know, they gave me a very good foundation to grow on. Richard Pena graduated from NTMA three years ago. And before that? Uh, I was a carpenter. In fact, we found a lot of machinists who used to be carpenters. Horacio is also an NTMA graduate. And how long did you go to NTMA? About well, seven months. And then you got this job? Yeah. EJ's is proud of its NTMA graduates, and their certificates are displayed. We believe that our graduates uh, from NTMA are professionals, and uh, we'd like to recognize them as such. When you go in a doctor's office, the doctor displays his degrees, and same thing with a lawyer. So we believe that our graduates um, ought to be proud of the training that they've received, and so we display their certificates. I'll tell you more about NTMA, its programs, and how you can be a part of it in a moment. Call NTMA at 800-962-NTMA or go to trainingcenters.org. These students are learning a new career as a machinist at NTMA, the National Tooling and Machine Association. And this could be the best buy for your future. And look closely. You'll see some students are just out of high school, while others are over 55 years old, men and women. And some of these students had other careers first, Lynn Evans is optimistic about her new career. The way the economy is going, I don't think it's going to affect this as far as jobs go because things have to be made. Everything you look at, you know, requires some bit of machinery or program writing or something. So I think it's going to be a pretty secure future. So this is a new career for you? Oh, yeah, completely, completely. Before you did what? Break horses. Like you were a cowboy? Um, basically, training horses. These young men are optimistic about jobs. It's a field you can go and take it internationally. You can basically work this uh, trade anywhere in the world. Being a machinist is now a high-tech job, and NTMA will teach you how to use tools and computers for jobs in aerospace, automotive, medical, and manufacturing businesses. This might surprise you. A high school diploma is not required. And you can graduate here in months, not in years. This is very important. Financial aid is available for those who qualify. Richard Jamie is an instructor. In the first six weeks, what they learn is uh, how to read the blueprint. They learn a lot of the uh, 
fractional math, how to uh, convert a fraction into a decimal form. Um, all of the things that uh, go along with that as far as dimensioning, um, as far as uh, learning how to make the first couple of parts, you know, very simple parts in the beginning, and they become more intense when they get into the second, third, fourth module. Some of the guys and gals coming in here don't have a high school diploma. Mm -hmm. How do you turn lives around like that? Well, all of us, all of the instructors here, we do the best we can. What I try to do is I try to get them on a, on a level to where they don't feel intimidated by those who do, you know. Uh, I try very hard not to treat anybody any differently. I encourage them to get at least a GAD. Um, you know, it's not the difficult thing. We have a program here that will help them get that GED. And um, just teach them, you know, teach them and, and treat them like uh, you would anybody else. But you must be turning lives around by being able to offer this opportunity. I like to hope so. You know, uh, we've had some some students come in, uh, never even seen a micrometer or caliper, or never even knowing how to run any type of machine. Um, I've had students who uh, single parents, uh, both men and women. You know, and uh, I feel as long as I can keep the lines of communication open and just be there for them as much as possible, I like to think that we can turn their life around. And when you turn their lives around, they go from what to what? They go from just your simple everyday person, you know, uh, not offending anybody's profession or what they've done, but people who have worked in warehouses or driven forklifts or driven trucks, to machinists, uh, being able to make a part, being able to get a, just a simple piece of metal and uh, form it into something tangible. Tell me how you've turned income levels around from somebody who walked in here, what were they doing before, what are they doing now? Um, I've had students that have, that have started here making minimum wage uh, at uh, any one of the fast food restaurants. And uh, I have had students leave here uh, with a starting pay of anywhere from 12 to $18. And all I've asked them to do is apply themselves to be here every day, to pay attention to what we're doing, pay attention to the detail. And this career can take them a, uh, a long way. It can take them as far as they want to go. And this training can also lead to supervisor and programmer jobs. A friend of mine, his father uh, is a programmer, like he was saying, he does the programming, the computers, telling the machines what to do. He topped out about 150 a year. Michael Kerwin is president of the NTMA Training Centers. He showed me some graduation photos. We have students who are 18 years old and just out of high school. We also have students who are 55 years old plus who are back into school trying to get a new career. We have story upon story of students who have been hired on the spot. The NTMA training centers are in Ontario and Norwalk. Call for information and a tour, 800-962-NTMA, or go to trainingcenters.org. Get rid of that dead-end job. Put an end to your unemployment. Call NTMA at 800-962-NTMA or go to trainingcenters.org. Machinists make it. If you're not making it, call now. I'm Alan Mendelson for NTMA. Thanks for watching. I went to the school, I signed up six months later, graduated, seven months, making pretty good money, living how I want to live, doing a lot of things that I like doing, and I haven't, I haven't looked back since. I'm going on four years this month. And you came right out of NTMA? Right out of NTMA, yes, sir. Got the right training there, obviously, huh? I believe so. I believe they showed me uh, introductory into the machining world and exposed me to a lot of what's out here. Before you went to NTMA, what did you do? Before I went to NTMA, uh, well, first I was in the Marine Corps. Yeah, I saw it on the TV and I thought, well, you know, at least go down and try it. And they were so helpful. They were very nice. They, they made it a snap just to sign up. And I, I was so happy with the program. Campuses are in Norwalk and Ontario, 800-962-NTMA, 800-962-NTMA, or trainingcenters.org.